All right, here we got a 2005 Ford Explorer XLT. Got the V6 4.0 liter automatic transmission, four wheel drive, and right at 154,000 miles. Do a little walk around on it. Pretty clean SUV. It's got a few little defects, I'll point them out. It's a little small crack in the bumper right there. It kind of goes right over through here. It's got good uh, tires on all the way around. They're at least 50%, probably more like 75% tread. They all match. It's got the 17 inch alloy wheels on it. Scuffs right there. Has the normal Explore crack in the hatch right there. <coughs> Got the towing package on the back. Be a little wave in the panel right there. You can kind of see where the reflection's kind of bowing. Yeah, there's a little wave in the panel right there. But pretty clean. Oh, and there is a small crack in the windshield right there. It's about three inches long. A little crack right there in the windshield. It's got the keyless entry on the door. It's got the cloth interior. Power seats. The switch on this is actually missing. You can still uh, move it just by pushing it and then the handle on this is moved. Or I'm sorry, not moved. Um, missing um, I'm gonna order some handles but those are missing on it right now it's also got the sunroof up top engine runs good and strong transmission shifts good a four-wheel drive goes in and out everything seems tight on it there's no uh, service lights on or anything also got the onboard computer to where you can change you know your temperature outside your trip your miles till empty average miles a gallon all that and your four-wheel drive it engages got an aftermarket uh, CD player in it there's all your climate control your traction control buttons down there Oh, it's also got the adjustable uh, pedals too. Moves your pedals in and out to get them closer to you if you need them to. Here's the back seat. I got this folded up right now and that's how you would get into the third row in the back. And when you're done with that, it just folds up. Folds down. And there's your back seat. trunk space and these have the nice uh, fold down seats makes it really easy just to slide something else in there you just push that like that and you got a lot more space in the back if you need it passenger side Engine compartment.
And I believe that's it. If you got any other questions, feel free to give us a call.